You've probably been hearing about human metanumovirus. It's being billed as the virus you've never heard of. And it's probably true. You probably never heard about it. I'm going to tell you what it is, how it's diagnosed, the symptoms, etc. The reason why we're talking about human metanumovirus is because the CDC recently announced that um, they saw a spike in human metanumovirus cases over the last few months. Um, it's kind of following the trend that we've seen like with RSV and other viruses as we sort of come out of the COVID pandemic. Uh, COVID is still happening, but we are seeing other viruses as well. The thing about human metanumovirus, first of all, do not be panicked, okay? This is a virus that causes upper respiratory and lower respiratory symptoms. What does that mean? It causes things like cough, shortness of breath, fever, chills, you know, things, runny nose, stuff like that. Cold symptoms for most people. Yes, it can turn into a bronchitis, cause a bronchitis or a pneumonia, but most people kind of get cold symptoms. It can affect people of, of any age, really. And the truth of the, of the matter is, honestly, in the office setting, um, you know, we don't necessarily test for that particular virus. If we see you have cold symptoms, we sort of treat you like you have a cold. Um, it can be tested for, though, in some environments. Uh, treatment is what we call supportive. That means we give you fluids and rest and, and, and medications to help you get through your symptoms. There is no specific treatment for that particular virus though. And I think the biggest thing here is prevention, washing your hands, making sure that you're uh, being very careful. This is a virus that spread through upper respiratory secretions and touching objects with secretions and things like that. So the same rules apply here. Uh, but guys, you know, I, I don't want you to worry, but it's important to just stay informed about what human metanumovirus is.